A subgrid is a grid attached to another grid by way of an advanced block. These blocks have two parts, such as the hinge and hinge part. Each of these blocks must be completed to have full function of the block and allow for conveyor pass-through, if available. However, power may pass through a subgrid even if the block is not complete. The grid you are interacting with or controlling is identified as the main grid, and its components are displayed in the control panel with white colored text. Items of the same grid will be the same color, while subsequent subgrids will be different colors. You cannot change the color of the text of the subgrids, and the color will change based upon where you are accessing the control panel from. Subgrids are grids themselves. They can be named in the info tab and should be in order to keep track of them more easily. Subgrids do not receive movement inputs from the main grid. Subgrids can occupy the same space as neighboring blocks, which can lead to intricate design. However, if these blocks are forced to collide, a physics engine will attempt to rectify the interaction, usually resulting in phantom forces. Do not cause clang and enrage clang. You were warned.